While homeowners were trying to get the bugs out, one pesky thief made his way inside to steal from them. Police say one man is responsible for burglarizing a dozen homes while they were being fumigated. Jamel Lene joins us live right now from the St. Petersburg Police Department where they are checking for even more victims, Jamel. Good evening to you both. Yeah, they say that this guy, David Cooper, he basically went around targeting these homes for the last five weeks. He basically went around and saw any home that was tented. That's where he would basically go in and, and make off with these items. And right now they are checking to see if there are any more cases. AJ Lambden is at the St. Pete Police Station to recover his stolen items. Police say his laptop, tablet, and jewelry were taken by this man, David Cooper, who burglarized a dozen homes while they were tented. I realized that our back bedroom had just been basically, you know, turned over and all of our stuff was just rummaged through and, and that's when we realized that they had stolen quite a few things from us including his grandfather's watch unfortunately not on the table vintage watch that was handed down from my grandfather to my father detectives tell us cooper began targeting houses around the city five weeks ago it started in the middle of may um, and then some other detectives started to get certain cases with certain mo's investigators say cooper previously worked with pest control companies so he'd sneak in when it was safe so while working for these companies, he knew what it took to fumigate the house and what type of chemicals were in there. Uh, he was able to go up to the houses, un undo the clamps, slit the tent with a knife, and crawl inside. Making off with valuables, ammo, and guns. Cooper was arrested during a traffic stop with one of the weapons on him. Lambden is glad he's off the streets. It was a, a tough struggle for about a week to really feel secure in the house, but, um, you know, I'm, I'm really glad and ecstatic that they caught the guy and, you know, hopefully he can understand exactly what it what he did. And detectives tell us the best way to protect your home. First, you need to ask questions. The company that's fumigating your house, you need to ask them what's their lockup system, and if it's mandatory that they leave a window a window open during the process. If that is the case, it's probably best at that point to get security cameras around your property just for your protection, Jen. So much to think about. Jamel Lene, live in St. Petersburg for us tonight. Thank you.